And now I'm joined by Trevor Dan, Creative Director of the Trevor Dan Company, who is working on commissions from BBC Radio's 2, 4 and 5 Live. Thank you for joining me, Trevor. It's a pleasure to be here. OK, so um, have you enjoyed the festival so far? Very much so far. I mean, I've done nothing except ask questions in my role as a moderator on a panel and then be asked questions by other people. But so far, no, it seems to be going very well. It's a lovely venue. And what do you think the objectives are for the, today's event? Well, I think it's always good to get people in the creative industries to talk to each other. There's a lot of silo thinking. I, I think if you work in radio, you don't meet people from telly. And if you're in telly, you may not meet people from online. And it's always good to have, you know, what in academia is called cross-discipline conversation. I think uh, we're doing a bit of that in media today, which is good. And how far does your involvement with so social media go? Like, do you have Twitter? Do you use Oh, Facebook? I'm at Trevor Dan. Of course I am. Yeah. In fact, that's why I was just getting my iPad out, so I could take a picture of you, oh, okay. which I shall then tweet. <laughs> Because that's how the modern world works. Yeah, so you you're... can't catch me out, even though I am an elderly man. Um, no, I think, that, I think social media is absolutely vital, isn't it? And I think in my industry, which is radio, if we don't engage with uh, young people who are on social media, we're going to be running a dying industry. So we've got to make sure that as radio programmers, we're, we're, we're on Facebook and we're on Twitter and we're, we're engaging with people where they are. We're not just sitting back saying, we're great, come and find us. Brilliant. Thank you, Trevor.